Welcome to your monthly dose of hiring data. I'm Raya Moss, Director of Data Insights and Customer Intelligence at iSIMS. iSIMS is the talent cloud company that empowers organizations to attract, engage, hire, and advance the right talent that builds a diverse winning workforce. We're seeing some interesting shifts in workforce and hiring dynamics this month. Let's dig in. Employers are ready to get back to work. We're seeing 10% growth in job openings. This is the second consecutive month these numbers are rising, and we expect that we're going to start to see elevated hiring activity very soon. However, job seeker interest may slow us down. We saw a rise from December's low, but candidates are submitting 8% less applications than they were last year at this time. This is especially strange behavior given the unemployment situation. Typically, these numbers would rise hand in hand. Despite new hiring challenges and less applications coming in, we are seeing time to fill declining. We believe last year's tech boom and the rise in virtual hiring is responsible. Employers shaved anywhere from a day to five days off their hiring process across all industries. We're seeing some really interesting generational shifts in the workforce as well. There have been a lot of reports on working parents and millennial job seekers as of late, but our data actually shows that 25 to 44 year olds are beginning to apply to jobs at pre-pandemic levels. This may be an anomaly, but it also might be an early indication of a new normal. And finally, we're also seeing a huge surge of Gen Z job seekers. Applications from 18 to 24 year olds are up 68%. This group has a lot of factors at play. Some graduated at the height of the pandemic and were unable to find jobs while others delayed college enrollment this past fall. Check out the full report for more hiring insights, including an update on diversity in tech and remote work trends. Download it now at isims.com insights.